God of life and love, you have brought Nicole and Tyler to this glorious day and united them in holy matrimony and surrounded them with this loving community. We ask that you continue to pour out upon them your extravagant, joyful, radiant love that they have reflected for us today. From the bottom of my heart, thank you. Putting everything I have to say in, is without a question an impossible task. How in the world would I be able to convey my love for you in one letter? As I'm sure you would imagine, this letter has been written and rewritten multiple times, striving to be perfect for you in every way. What I realized is that there's, instead of trying to put everything I feel in one letter, I wanted to instead thank you. First of all, thank you for choosing me to carry your heart with me in this life. Every step I have taken in this journey has prepared me to be the man you have always wanted. And I want you to know how much it means to me that you chose me to hold your heart through this journey. Thank you for choosing me. the best story of your life. That's what I consider our love, the stuff of tales you spend so long wondering at and praying they can be real. That's what you've given me. So what can I possibly give you in return? Here's what I promise to try for. Super hard, and then I want to party. You know? Yeah. I think we can accomplish that. Awesome. You know what I mean? I think so too. I need you right now. I want to be next to you. You want to be next to me. I'm holding our paper hearts. I lasted no time. I want to be next to you. You want to be next to me. Holding our paper hearts. Fading our broken dreams. Feeling worn out, it's getting to me 
Lost some heart trying to get on my feet Caught in the madness, I feel you somehow Don't let me go, I need you right now I wanna be next to you, you wanna be next to me Holding our paper hearts, fading our broken dreams I wanna be next to you, you wanna be next to me Holding our paper hearts, fading our broken dreams I wanna be next to you for allowing me to love you. It is truly remarkable how it feels like every day is the first day I laid eyes on you. I vow to try every day to make you feel as cherished, treasured, and adored as you make me, which is a lot. I vow to try to be slow to anger, but I can vow to always change the light bulb and never let the darkness win. Something you help me with yourself. These words will be ringing in my ears throughout this special day and the rest of my life. I vow to hold your heart with me wherever I go and whatever I do faithfully, lovingly, and graciously. All together, I vow to love you enough for two black times. Thank you to the love of my life for joining me on the journey for every year's time. So today, um, before the wedding, Tyler and I were the only two that were not allowed to see Nicole in her dress. So she gave me the first look and it was really hard to see it. <laughs> she was so beautiful. Just reminded me of some times when you were young and 
had a hard time getting to sleep. And I would come and grab you and we'd go out in the living room and we'd dance a little bit and dance to some Mariah. And <sighs> <sighs> yeah, and some boys to men. We can't forget about that. Um, and then uh, the times I got to coach you for basketball, that was not... <laughs> It's kind of hard to think that you were going to have a successful career at 5-1, at, at, at and then you never grew. But uh, so, and then another one of my fondest memories was a lot in part to Tyler here, was a couple of years ago, you and I getting to spend a weekend in Pittsburgh at a Steelers game. I just want you to know that there isn't a day that goes by that I don't thank God that he gave me you as my daughter. And then, and then there's Tyler. started talking about music and then I think it clicked from there because everything he talked about him and I were going back and forth ACDC journey all that stuff and it yes damn Yankees I just wasn't sure if I could cuss but so so everything you know I'm going through the night and I'm pounding down some Dr. Peppers and we got to the end of the evening when Tyler was leaving and I went to shake his hand and I said well I think that was a great first date <laughs> and from there I mean luckily he came back I, I just want you to know I am a big fan and I, I know you're gonna be successful in whatever you do and, uh, just always remember why you guys fell in love. Cheers to the Funks. Thank you.